Hello and welcome to another video of BigQuery SQL based machine learning model tutorials. In this video, we're going to talk about XGBoost classifier. We are going to use the data that we used for the logistic regression cla classification model in the previous video. So this is how you would write XGBoost classification model. Create or replace model the name of the model with the data set options again boosted tree classifier input label columns purchased as in the previous video we are using the target column as purchased we are predicting purchased yes or no learn rate the alpha and early stopping equals to true as discussed early stopping means that if the model sees no further improvement during the training process, it stops training there. In no further improvement, meaning no further decrease in the loss curve, the gradient descent function. And then here you are talking about the query with the user ID less than this number, I'm using this for my training purposes. Once the model is trained, we are gonna so this is how the model will be done training. You would see this model here, and then we will evaluate the model. As from the previous videos, the evaluation will be done using select star from ml.evaluate model, the name of the model. Once we are satisfied with the evaluation parameters like precision, recall, accuracy, F1 score, and other metrics, we are going then to use the model for prediction of the unseen, the validation data set. If you remember, during the training, we used less than this number. Now we are using greater than this number of records. This is just a method of how I used to split the data for training and testing purposes. For predictions, I'm gonna use select star from ml.predict model and the name of the model. So let's quickly dive in and see for yourself how it works. So this is the XGBoost classification model and you would be able to see the XGBoost, I'm not gonna run the train because it's gonna take a lot of time. You can use this uh, query and modify it for yourself. And by the way, the link of this script is in the video description section below. So when you run this statement, you're gonna create this model, MDL XGBoost purchase model. Next, we are going to run evaluate and clicking on run. This is the precision recall, accuracy, F1 score, log loss, and various other things. And finally, to predict the model, we are gonna use ml.predict as we discussed. So running this query, I'm just selecting this query and click on run. This is how you would see the predicted. So label predicted is zero. And this is the probability with 99.52% confidence probability. It says that this is gonna be zero. And this is the actual purchased. So this is a predicted purchased column it predicts zero and let's look at one, there you go. So with 94% probability, it's able to predict that the label here for this particular record is one and it turns out to be one. Now, in the previous video, we used the export the in the logistic regression uh, video. A task for you would be use that export query or export logic and try exporting this model out to the, to the cloud storage bucket. In the next video, we're gonna talk about, uh, this is how the prediction works. And then we're gonna talk about the DNN, the deep neural net classifier. Thank you for watching. 